Okay, is it 95 degrees where you are? Because you know what that means? Summer's around the corner, which means it's grilling season. So if you want something that tastes good, then watch this video because I'm gonna cook chicken. Keeping with the vibe and the theme of being healthy, um, I came up with a little marinade for this grilled chicken that I'm gonna do. You just need some honey, limes, salt, pepper, and you can throw anything else you want in it, um, and olive oil, and a champagne vinegar. And you also need a sous chef. Come here, trouble. Say hi, trouble. So we're gonna do the marinade for the chicken, and then I'm gonna show you how to make, I think, the best asparagus. So I've been experimenting with some vegetables, and so tonight with the grilled chicken, we're gonna do uh, uh, a really easy asparagus that tastes amazing. So again, this is easy. Get your little measuring cup out. Three-fourths cup of olive oil and your champagne vinegar. Uh, okay. Then it's salt and pepper to taste. When I wrote it down uh, for my friend for the recipe, I said a teaspoon of salt, a teaspoon of pepper, but really it's just, you'll know, you'll know when you know, you'll know what you like. Uh, so I do five tablespoons of fresh lime juice, which is in here, um, and it's about three limes. So if you don't feel like measuring it all out, just squeeze three limes as long as they're nice and juicy. So I do three fourths cups of honey. That was an unpleasant sound. Well, this is gonna take time. You'll be here till Christmas, so. Hold, please. 2,000 years later. Let it drizzle. Drip, 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 In my household, which consists of myself, Josh, and Trouble Joshua Lloyd, we're a garlic family, okay? We love garlic. We're only making out with each other, so we don't care. So, that was my teaspoon of fresh garlic. Mix it all up. Told you. Very, very easy. This is what your marinade looks like because I'm making this tonight um, and I had already done it because that's what Josh wanted for dinner tonight. Happy wife, happy life. I'd already put it in. So I, I like to marinate it all day. So I did this this morning at like nine o'clock. We'll probably eat tonight at seven. So it's been in the refrigerator. Just dump your chicken breasts in there, move it all around, massage it. The minimum time, you need to marinate for two hours, and, or like you do, like I love like at least eight hours because you just get that flavor and then you put it on the grill. But now, it's the easy breezy asparagus. I know, you're gonna be like, Bobby, you're a genius. I know, I can, I can hear you saying it now. Nice little Ziploc bag. Got my little asparagus, garlic salt. Now again, this is to taste, so I literally, I just count. One, two, three, four, five, okay? Olive oil, same thing. You can stop there if you like, but I add turmeric because it has a lot of health benefits um, to yourself. One, two, three, close it up. Or if you don't really want to shake your in a bad mood, just This, you take this, you put it in the refrigerator, and then you cook dinner, you know, when your other half is coming home. You put this in the refrigerator, I'll be right back. That part's done. We're gonna go outside with the puppy, maybe watch the sunset or something. We'll see you in a little bit. Josh just got home, which means I'm about to cook since, you know, it's Friday night. So, Take your little asparagus that have been in there for a while, put them on your cookie sheet. It's just 400 degrees for 10 minutes. Oh yeah. Okay. So the grill is on. Got your little, got your little chickadee. Place it on the grill. I mean, easy as pie. So now we'll let those cook for a little bit. We'll check them, make sure the temperature's right, flip them, put the asparagus in the oven, and then bon appetit. Ladies and gentlemen, I think our chicken is done. Look how crispy that looks. That little fella, that's for me. Time to use our little friend, Kraft. Don't be hating on my Kraft, okay? Since childhood. 
back in for one minute. Phenomenal. Ooh. My favorite. Actually, usually I try a, a bite. I don't care if he's honest, but try a bite. I need a new food critic because I tasted it before, just it was a test to him. It tastes better than the last time I made it. So either way, very healthy, low calories, tons of protein. Like there's no carbohydrates. All right, I guess until next time, bye.